Well, as the weather cools down and we get into the holiday season, more and more people look towards shelters and other forms of assistance. And right now we have Tony Cooper of the Jimmy Hale Mission here with us today. Thank you for joining us. Oh, Lenore, good to see you. What is it about the holidays that that makes you guys so busy? Well, you know, it's Thanksgiving, you know, and people are reminded of how blessed they are. And so I think their thoughts turn to the less fortunate, especially during the holidays. And so, you know, uh, that's a good thing, though. It because is a very good thing. Uh, during the last two months of the year, we'll take in about 60% of our annual financial contribution. So it's good that we're busy, kind of like retail. If you don't get it at the year end, then, then, then it really doesn't come in. And mm -hmm. so we're busy that way. But certainly busy with more volunteers, more people want to get involved, you know, and, and, and uh, give back to the community by volunteering. And then also clientele increases as well. As it gets colder, then we have more people to serve, more mouths to feed, more needs to address. And so certainly it gets kind of busy in several areas. Now, a lot of people think of you guys as just a shelter, but I mean, you, got, you guys are much, much more than a shelter. Give us an idea of all of the services that you guys offer, because you offer so many good services. Sure. Well, briefly, yes, we start with the shelter. You know, that's, where, that's kind of where it begins, but that's the entry point, not the exit point. Mm -hmm. Then we have long-term recovery programs. And a part of those recovery programs are learning centers where we do education remediation and job readiness. We've helped over 1,100 people find jobs and get back to work wow. since 2006. Had people learn how to read through our learning centers at Jimmy Hill Mission. Um, so we, ha we have bargain center thrift stores as well. And then we also have discovery clubs, which are after school Bible clubs and public elementary schools. So those are a variety of things that come under the umbrella of Jimmy Hill Mission. So, when, when, so it is so important for people to give and a few dollars makes a difference and it's not just going for meals per se, but it's going to all of those programs. Sure, dollar 95 will sponsor a meal. So that's what we talk about. You know, if, if you have an extra dollar 95, don't think that that dollar 95 doesn't help because it will, or you can sponsor as many meals as you would like. But a dollar 95 not only can sponsor a meal, Honora, it can, it can be the, you know, the, the start of a changed life. We say a changed life can begin with something as simple as a meal. A lot of people will come to us because they're hungry or needing a place to mm -hmm. stay and then discover we have the long-term recovery program like you referred to that really help them get their lives back. So because we share the gospel message of hope and new life, we can say at Jimmy Hill Mission, our product is changed lives. Well, if people are interested in donating to you guys or volunteering, which I know you encourage year round, not just during <laughs> the holidays, how can people get in touch with you guys? Well, sir, they can call us d during business hours, 323-5878, but 24-7, probably the best way is on our website, Jimmy, and it, with an IE, I always have to say that, Jimmy with an IE, jimmyhillmission.com. Find out we have a secure donation page as well as volunteer opportunities are listed there as well. And all that information right there on your screen. Thank mm -hmm. you so much for joining us, Tony, to talk about holiday help. Good to see you. Have a blessed Thanksgiving. You